Hey guys, Andrew from Tech AF here, bringing you our very first tech tip. Uh, it's a shorter video, just made to describe something that we're having issues with, or have had issues with, and really haven't found much information on how to do, or think we can provide information on how to do, even if there is other information out there. Today we are flashing Emacs Nano 20 amp ESCs with BL Heli. Now. Why do I want to do a tech tip on this? Well, because I could not find documentation anywhere on how to do it, not even on any RC forum. Emacs simply said, just do it, pretty much in their replies. Just just do it. That That's not a very helpful response. So, there are a few ways people would assume you can go about doing it. One way is with one of these, a USB interface tool or with an Arduino. I use an Arduino Nano for most of my programming. That's a lie, I just got it today. Um, anyways, there's a, a few things that people would do. They'd set these up for BL Heli because in the documentation for these ESC it says it's BL Heli flashed. So one would think, oh I can just go set this up for BL Heli and then connect to it. Connect to my ESC, flash it again, change all my settings and be happy. Well, you'd be wrong. You'd be very wrong. The sad fact of life is that the Emacs 20 amp ESCs are a C2 interface, SI Labs C2. So what you're going to have to do is pull the heat shrink off the ESC, and along the top, there will be the four C2 pads, and you'll have to solder a cable to three of them to be able to program it. Once you do that, you set your Arduino up as a uh, four-way interface in BL Heli and go to the SI Labs C2 interface on the programmer. That get, that'll get shown in a second. Now, I'm not going to put screenshots up of any of the documentation that I used to figure out how to do this, um, but I am going to throw the documentation in the description. Now, this documentation doesn't just work for the Emacs 20 amps, it works for any ESC that has a C2 interface. One of them is specifically how to get um, how to get the BL Heli flashing tool to uh, interact with the C2 interface. What tools to use, how to hook it up, all that. The other one is what pads to solder to on specific ESCs. There's I think about 30 ESCs in this document, which is ridiculous, but they're all there. So even if you're not trying to flash uh, Emacs 20 amps, but it is a C2 interface, this document will help a lot. So without further ado, let's get into the screen capture and show you guys what I had to do in BL Heli. All right, guys. So I know it's kind of hard to see around here, but so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our Arduino uh, Nano, we're gonna plug it in, get it all connected, and we're gonna go to, over to Make Interfaces. We're gonna go with Arduino Four-Way Interface. C2 is what we need. So we're going to press OK. And we want to select either this one or this one. This one's from multiple ESCs. I haven't figured out how to do all of them at once. This one is the one I've been using currently and the one that's recommended. It's for a single ESC at once. So we're going to do that. Yes, we want to flash it. And we're making sure we have the right Arduino selected. I already had that selected. I'm sorry I didn't point it out. So we're going to see these indicator lights as it flashes and then we're going to get this nice message saying Arduino flash successfully by AVR dude. So I'm going to press OK. Now we're going to go over to SL, uh, SIL Labs or SI Labs ESC setup. We're going to go SI Labs C2 4-way interface. So now before we try and connect we're going to take our connector and making sure we know the black wires on the outside or on this side the white wires here and the red wires in the middle um, I know that's not the color coding I'm using right now but that's what it is so ground will connect to ground and we'll plug it in right so then before we try and connect we'll go ahead and we'll power up all my motors initialized there but that's because mine are already set up now we're gonna go to connect now all this you'll notice none of this changed you're gonna read the setup alright so this is motor one we're gonna flash BL Heli these are all 
everything you can put on here firmware wise we're going to find the ESC we have which is the Emacs Nano 20 amp select multi from multicopter and press OK we'll get to this message we're just going to click yes and it's going to write the flash to the uh, ESC and then read it to verify that it exists so here it is we flash the file uh, do I want to write the current setting? Yes, since this is the setting I had beforehand, I'll go ahead and write it. Then I'll read the setup again to make sure it's the same and reboot the ESC. And read it again just to make sure everything's the same, which it is. So, we do that for all four of the ESCs and then we're done. That's how you flash the Emacs Nano 20 amps with. Um, with BL Heli to enable one shot in your flight controller and just have an amazing flying experience. I personally love BL Heli. Uh, if you guys have any questions, go ahead and comment or message us. Uh, we'll get back to them as soon as possible. Um, if you have um, any concerns, go ahead and comment. If you need help, go ahead and comment. Um, yeah. Uh, like the video if you liked it, dislike it if you disliked it, don't forget to subscribe for more content, uh, as I said, comment or message any questions you guys have, I'm going to finish putting this thing together, uh, thanks for watching guys, oh, oh, quick point, when you flash with BL Heli, do not calibrate your ESCs again, like in your flight controller or with your remote, they're calibrated, you have set the minimum and max throttle, that's calibrating. Don't calibrate your ESCs. You will throw everything off. Um, or you could throw everything off. It's just better to not do it and not risk it. So with that, guys, thanks for watching. Like the video if you liked it. Dislike it if you disliked it. I'm saying all this again for no reason at all. Uh, don't forget to subscribe. You know the drill. Thanks for watching, guys. Stay awesome.